From nurse in Australia to successful farmer in Zambia. 34-year-old Maria Zalumis describes her unlikely change in occupation as an accident. She moved back to her home country after 12 years abroad due to her father's dementia. Maria couldn't find nursing work in Zambia because she was overqualified. So, six months later, decided to take over the reins of her family farm. It's a very busy life. Um, today I woke up at 5 a.m. We've been harvesting since 5.30 this morning. Uh, it's, uh, basically, I've got no time for anything else but the farming. But I, it's my passion. It's something that I love to do. So I don't look at it as a job. I look at it as a way of life. So for me, this is what I love. <laughs> Maria took over the farm in 2016. It's called Tuzini, an acronym for her and her siblings' names. The 40-hectare farm is located about 25 kilometers north of central Lusaka and produces predominantly tomatoes. It makes around 7,500 US dollars a year, most of which is plowed back into the farm. Maria is looking to grow her business, but remains focused on helping her community through literacy and building projects. And I like to help the less privileged. I think that's one thing that really pushed me into farming was helping people who haven't been to school, giving them jobs, reducing poverty, and then, you know, giving them a future. The farm employs over 70 people from local communities, including farm manager Thomas Taulu, who has been with Tuzini for about five years. When you're working, you need to make sure that you need to support the family. And uh, so that, Tuzini Farms has really helped me uh, to get an income, to help the family. You know, things are tough these days, but at least I've been able to help me in that one. Senzeni Ndebele is a mother of three and a casual worker at Tuzini Farm. Because of her work, she has been able to send all of her children to school. Now when we get paid, I pay school fees and my children can go to school. I keep paying every month and I have no problems. Maria doesn't regret the career change because for her, farming is a labor of love.